Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. So today I wanted to share with you Christmas gift ideas for him and her for under 150 euros. So if you want to know which items I picked and which gift ideas I have, then keep on watching. All right, you guys, so for me, I thought about what kind of gifts I would give to my boyfriend or my parents or other people in my life that I'm gifting for for Christmas. And um, I actually, for the gifts for her, I thought about things that I had received and that I really, really loved. And my favorite present that I got, or one of my favorite presents that I ever got, is um, my smack kettle. I have it right here. It's this beautiful, yeah, just turquoise kettle. These smack kettles come in so many different colors. They have pink, they have white, they have black. The black one, for example, or they, the all silver one is a perfect gift for a man in your life as well. This one is so high quality. The design is just like really pretty. They also have toasters. They have like milk foam machines. They have coffee machines, everything. And they're usually between 100 to 150 euros the mixer is more expensive but the like small electronic items are around that price mark and that was one of my favorite gifts I actually got it last Christmas from my fiance and it really made me happy and I use it almost every day for tea or my hot water bottle and other things like that and I just really like it because I think this will stand the test of time and this will always be something that I don't know it just brings me joy every day and it's something that I just find to be so pretty and useful and I just really like it so I love that gift idea and kind of like on the same note I actually wanted to recommend getting your loved ones if it's male or female good hair appliances an example for that would be my GHD um, styling iron because I've actually had it like the straightener I've had for probably like five years and it works wonderfully and of course GHD also has a uh like blow dryers and things like that which don't really break the bank i mean if you have the money to go for dyson airwrap for example that would be an awesome gift as well but i think ghd is an awesome brand with amazing quality lots of hairdressers use it as well and i just really like it it's also a really nice design as you can see for things like that i love turquoise it's like my favorite color for appliances so i always go for the turquoise if possible and i really really like this as a gift idea all right then my next idea would be like a glassware and i think this could go for both um, men and women i actually love glasses that have like a little gold rim around them these are actually my favorite they're by leonardo i will try and link some ones below but these ones are not available because I just broke one um, the other day and now I only have three left so I got these ones instead. They are actually for candles but I really like them as drinking glasses but just like really nice glasses like normal glasses or if um, for example your mother likes to drink wine then like really nice wine glasses. I actually bought some from H&M Home. They're in the mail right now so yeah I will show you in my upcoming haul video <laughs> but yeah like wine glasses or also like a nice whiskey glass or a nice beer mug or things like that something that you can use like the other person can use and I don't know just be happy about and think about you when doing so and what is even better is giving personalized gifts for example this one is my um, I gave all of my bridesmaids one of these glasses for our what's it called like for getting ready and stuff on my wedding day. So this one says Freya and Bride and it has a little heart right there. It's just like a champagne glass. And I got my other girls the same glass or when I asked my maid of honor to be my maid of honor, I gave her a little mug uh, with like pictures of us or I gave my dad like a couple years ago a little beer mug that said like his name and then like uh, best beer drinker since blah 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 and yeah he thought that was really funny so personalized stuff like this I also think is an awesome idea the 
best website to buy personalized gift from in my opinion is Etsy so I will link some Etsy shops that I bought from before down below that I've been really happy with the service and things like that I will link them down below because usually they ship worldwide and I just really like personalized gifts and now you still have a couple more weeks so they will probably get here in time which I really yeah would recommend you guys doing it right now so you have a little more time to order these things because they usually take like two to three weeks so um, it comes in time for Christmas but personalized things are amazing and like glassware and things they can use like personalized mugs and things like that I think I an awesome gift idea also something that I gave all of my bridesmaids for my wedding for getting ready is like a little robe that is personalized so this is mine obviously it says bride and Freya my name <laughs> But yeah, something like that, something personalized, like a robe, because I just feel like you wear a robe like every time you go out of the shower, or at least I do. And I feel like this is something nice and something kind of luxurious and something your own you're putting on. So I think this would be an amazing gift and you can just like, I don't know, personalize a sweater with like your favorite inside joke and or like a t-shirt or something like i think it's such a nice idea and it's something you would never usually do for yourself so i feel like it's so nice to give um that to somebody you love and also very very thoughtful because um yeah you just i don't know you just cannot buy it like that in the store which i find to be like really good so um i really like personalized gifts and i like to give them to other people as well also you can get like little christmas baubles and things like that um that will be a cute idea i've never done this before this is a good idea i need to keep that in the back of my mind but yeah this is something of course you can do it yourself if you're really creative but if you're not that good at it or if you simply don't have the time etsy is amazing for that then something like more of like an experience and i know that's maybe not that possible at the moment but even like another city in your own country i feel like you could travel to another city in your country and maybe like yeah just spend the day there if possible spend the night there get some local food um just like spend a whole day together with that person and like treat them to like the whole day like gas and food and everything like entrance and things like that i feel like that's amazing and that's something i do all the time instead of giving material gifts i like to give experiences as gift I, in my opinion that's the best thing you can gift somebody um, is your time so that is something that I like and I just wanted to throw in here really quickly if you haven't thought about that but I feel like even I don't know just like doing like a really nice breakfast with the other person something that makes them happy is like yeah just I don't know not uh, you can't buy that with money so yeah just like experiences or I don't know spending like a day with a person in a shopping mall or going to like an amusement park and things like that just like a concert maybe things like that all right so and then we come to like two really obvious things that a lot of people think about but in my opinion I feel like jewelry is a really nice gift idea and there are a lot of um, amazing jewelry brands that are below 150 euros my favorite one for girls are purely I got this necklace from them and then also Sephira I got this necklace and these earrings from them um, also I love Tomasabo and Pandora and yeah those are like a really good like middle price jewelry brands that i really stand by and that i feel are um just like amazing for gift giving and for men i really like hugo boss and armani they have really nice jewelry i will insert some pictures of some stuff that i found online that i really liked but i've bought from these brands before for dominic and also my dad i think so yeah, this is something really nice you could give to the man or woman in your life. And then something that I uh, is highly personal, I feel like, but still I wanted to give some advice on perfumes that I feel like you can never go wrong with. Two of my favorite perfumes are actually 
the YSL Black Opium. This is one of my favorite perfumes. I think this is like my third bottle. This one is like a kind of heavier scent. So this is for me is more of like a winter and also nighttime appropriate scent, but I still really like it. The quality is amazing. This holds so long. So yeah, I just really like that. And also one of my favorite scents is Armani C. I want to spray that. So good. And yeah, this one is not as heavy, but it's just, I don't know, it just, it, it smells so nice. It, I've, I've worn it for probably like eight years or something like that. And it's just really, really like that scent. It's not too heavy. It's also something you can wear um, during the warmer months, but maybe more at the nighttime. It's yeah, just a really, really nice scent. I can't even explain how that smells, but these two are amazing. And sometimes, especially around Christmas, they will have like little gift sets. That's something that I got from uh, my mother-in-law for last Christmas, but I haven't used them because I still have so many perfumes to use up before I use these and I haven't tried them so they can't go bad. So that's a good thing, but like little gift sets like that where you can have like multiple perfumes to give to your loved ones and for them to try out is amazing. And then also three perfumes for him that I really love. I stole these from my boyfriend, but this is the One Million by Paco Rabanne. I've loved this perfume <laughs> since 15 years. And um, I also own the female, like the Lady Million, but I actually don't like that one that much but I love the one million for just men because I just really like the smell and I feel like a lot of in Germany when I was younger a lot of boys bought that perfume and wore it and I feel like this one fits with a lot of different I don't know body types or body smells whatever but I also feel like um, it works for many age groups because this is like a young and fresh but also kind of sophisticated so i feel like 40 year old man can wear this as well as like a 15 year old boy in my opinion so i really like this for men and then one that i really like um it's called the mont Blanc legend this one is more sophisticated so this one is more like an older scent um but still it's my boyfriend's and he's only 28, but I really love that smell. This one is really nice if he's wearing like a suit or goes to work and things like that. More like sophisticated business environments. I really love when he wears this one. This one is super, um, super good. A little bit heavier, but I'm um, still really, really nice. And I like that a lot. And then also I found this one. I don't even know where he got it, but it, I found the, out the name and it's called Mandarina Duck pure black and this one is only around like a 30 euros and i just really like this for like every day the design is also super chic and sophisticated if you can see so i really like that one and yeah i just think this is amazing for just like everyday wear it's not too too much it's just like a really nice scent that it's not um also if you wear it um, to work or something like that, I don't think it gives you a headache because that's often the problem. So I th just think this is amazing and I would highly recommend one of these three perfumes. So then I need to hurry a little bit. So I got another idea for like the women in your life. Something I always like is either good skincare, but that's highly personal as well. What I really love is giving makeup palettes. So I actually received this one from some friend of mine for my birthday so like a little nude makeup palette this is the born this way natural nudes by Too Faced also a palette that I really love is this MAC palette with like uh, neutral shades and like little glitters and things like that I really love MAC and Naked the Naked palettes uh, from Urban Decay for gift giving for example so something like that like a nice makeup palette something that you don't buy yourself every day and then one last example for male and women would be just some comfy little PJs or like a comfy sweater some comfy pants these are both from H&M this is like a pair of white just um, white leg little knitted pants that are really comfortable like a knitted sweater and also for men this is 
a pair of joggers that is from my boyfriend's brand i will link the, them down below if you're interested his uh, company is called arum and yeah these are super comfortable for men as well and they also kind of look cute so you could go like to the post office and um to go grocery shopping with them as well which i think is a good thing but something like especially nowadays during like all of this pandemic corona thing i feel like it's so yeah essential to feel good at home and to be comfortable and yeah just to have something you feel good in so i think that's an amazing christmas idea i know lots of people are gifting socks but i feel like comfy clothes are actually yeah just a really nice uh, gift idea so i hope you really enjoyed the gift ideas that i had for you these were um a lot but i thought why not just give you guys options and maybe you haven't tried gifting one or the other of these things and you i don't know just needed an idea so if you did please give me a thumbs up and other than that i will see you for my next video which will be um a gift guide for under 500 euros so if you want to know what i picked for these items then click in on next time and subscribe down below so you don't miss any of my videos i will see you then bye bye